Hey everybody, I hope everyone is starting to recover and is feeling better rested after this past weekend. I've been meaning to do this video a lot sooner, but I've just been so knackered after the challenge. I've still got big bags under my eyes and tonight has been the first night that I've actually managed to sleep properly. So I am starting to feel a bit more human now, whereas the rest of this week I've been feeling quite zombified. But um, yeah, man, what a weekend it has been. I'm not exaggerating when I say the past weekend was the best weekend I have experienced this entire year, and I'm sure it's the same for Nathan. Everything went beyond our greatest expectations. Not only did we hit our, um, <laughs> our fundraising goal before we are even halfway through the challenge, it wasn't even something we were expecting to hit during the weekend, um, but... The turnout that we had, the people that returned for the challenge, the memories that we had, just everything was magical, memorable. It really was one of the best challenges ever, if not the best. I know a lot of people have said it's their favorite challenge they've experienced. So everyone who was there, a part of the ride, donated, joined in for the fun, was there in the chat. Honestly, thank you so, so much for making this such an incredible journey to be a part of. Um, you guys are probably going to rip me for saying this and I try not to be sentimental too often in these videos but honestly I've never had tears of joy before but once the challenge had finished and the stream went offline <laughs> I just started bawling just completely overwhelmed at what we've managed to achieve over the past six months nonetheless it's been, only been six months since we started doing content again at the start of the Covid times and it's just incredible what we've managed to achieve. Um, you know, like, I'm so grateful and I feel like we're some of the luckiest people ever. I mean, me, Nathan, Izzy, we've always said this, we're not some of the best people at Resident Evil games. There are hundreds and hundreds of other channels out there for the fastest speed runs and some of the craziest playthroughs. But that doesn't really seem to matter. You guys come back and watch our videos for us, for the memories, for the fun, for the excitement, um, for, for the whole ride. So um, yeah, I can't believe that it has been going on for 15 years and I'm gonna do everything I can to do more than 15 years just to keep this going as long as we can keep doing them. So um, yeah, it really has been magical. So um, yeah, as we said quite a while ago that if we did hit 10K, we would be doing a Resident Evil Challenger meetup, which I know sounds like a real big thing to a lot of people who live in the States and those who aren't in the UK, or even some of those that are further in the UK from the Southeast, you know, that might be up North or Wales or Ireland or Scotland. This UK meetup is open to everyone. And everyone who's a fan of Resident Evil Challenger, everyone who's a fan of Resident Evil, you are all invited to come down Obviously, we can't really confirm any details at the moment because of obvious reasons, but in time, we will be able to announce some more details. All I can say is we're planning to do it in London, hopefully next summer, next year. I'm hoping by summer next year that whole COVID thing will have died down a lot more. And also we've got the Challenge 2021 next year, which will be June the 6th, which we're planning to do. And it'll be quite nice if we could do the meetup around that sort of day. So yeah, keep, stay tuned and I'll provide more details as and when. But honestly, if you're a fan in the States or ever abroad, please consider coming because we'd love to meet all of you. Some of you we've been speaking to online for, you know, like 10, 15 years or so. And I know there have been a lot of friendships and a load of members that have made friendships with each other that would love to meet each other. So use this opportunity to come over to the UK, to come down to London, try it for the first time, meet a, lot of, meet a load of other gamers, meet Nathan, Izzy, we'll all be there, Matt will be there. So yeah, it'll be a cool opportunity where we'll hopefully be able to do some gaming together and hopefully we'll be able to sort out some sort of in-person watch long, which I think would be quite fun. So we've done all of these digital ones, but I think an in-person screening of a challenge, maybe even the challenge 2021 would be really cool. So uh, yeah, that's what we've got looking forward. Um, I'm actually gonna have a little bit of a break from streaming for the next couple of weeks. Um, I'm actually moving house. So this is the final video, the final update. You'll be seeing me in this room. So I'm actually moving house next week. So the next few weeks I've got my hands tied up. But I haven't forgotten about my Revs 2 stream, which I will be doing at some point in the near future. We'll also be doing the Beat the Clock Challenge 3 as well. And yeah, there's loads of other stuff coming up. We're hoping to do something for Halloween too. So keep an eye out for that. 
But literally this weekend, Mullet Wesker will be doing a Resident Evil 2 remake knife only challenge. So I know a lot of people have been having post challenge blues, myself included hugely, a huge come down after the incredible highs that we had this weekend. So yeah, if you want to get the band back together, join this Saturday and uh, yeah, wish Mullet Wesker all the best. Um, yeah, once again, I've said it ad nauseum this year, but we just can't say thank you enough to all of you guys. It really is something else. And the money that we have raised for the two charities is just incredible. Um, this is also coming from Nathan and Izzy too. I know that Nathan was completely overwhelmed what we achieved. Um, yeah, I mean, I saw a side of Nathan that I haven't seen for years just because he was so excited for the challenge. Um, he really enjoyed every moment of it and was completely blown away by your generosity. So um, yeah, that was incredible stuff. So um, yeah, once again, thank you very much. And yeah, we shall see you guys soon. Resident Evil Challenger.